Oh my god. You, you want to tell what happened or should I? I'm not you didn't tell you I was so pissed. Was I not pissed? You can tell by my face. Alright, so we left the hotel. We are at the Grove now. We're walking with the crew. My flight is at what? 6.20? My flight's at 6.20, right? Me, everyone was in the hotel and I left my bag there with one of my friends, Mocha, right? And I, I left it there and then I went to check out, check out of the room. I come back, they're all at the car, everything's in the trunk. I ask them, I'm like, is my bag in there? He says, he says it is, Mocha said it is. I was like, all right, cool. So we come back. Freaking come back to Kaisa's house. Freaking, ball there too. He, he left the ball there oh, and he left my bag and he left the, my he ball too. My so listen, well, my ball's li look, look. So I have like five pairs of shoes in there. I have my some of my medicine stuff. I have my, like a lot of stuff in there and I'm like tripping out. I call them. They're like, oh, sorry, sir. No bag has been turned in. What is this? No, I didn't take right? An took an L. And then Mocha, you know, he had to redeem himself. So he called. And then he called security and they found the bag in the lobby, thankfully. And the balls. And the balls. I'm balls. surprised no one took those. Yeah. I'm totally and then... Um, I signed one too. It was signed. One of them was yeah. signed and the other one wasn't. And then my bag was there and the guy said, all right, we're just going to ship it to you. FedEx on them. Yeah, you know, free too. I told them that I have a flight Shout at LAX. Shout out to Marriott. Shout out to Marriott. Shout out to FedEx. I'm going to get my bag in like a week, but it's all good. Thankfully, it was found, and yeah. Better than having no bags. And a week of it. Freaking diabetic, and Kaisa brings me into a candy store. What is this? High blood sugar? I heard about your bag, I'm glad you got a bag. Yeah, and Mocha took an L, but then he took a W right after, you know? How are you doing though? Doing good, good. my back. My yeah, tailbone. No way. It's bruised. It's hurting? Really bad, so I'm gonna go to the doctor soon and have him. I think it's just bruised, but I just wanna make sure that nothing's wrong. Chiropractor. Yeah. Call me. Hey, if you guys know a chiropractor, put it in the comment section below. We at Nike right now, checking out some shoes. I'm not copping anything because I don't have a bag. Papa Q. You a vlogger? No. He's upset, I don't know why. But uh, I always come here and I'm gonna show you guys this real quick. You guys gotta know your history, you gotta know your roots, you know what I'm saying? They don't, they don't have any hole. Huh? They, they said they didn't, they didn't find it in the hole. So these are all the championships that he won in. Every, everyone who wears Jordan should know this. Six, seven, eight. He won his first three in those. 91, 92, 93. That was the first three-peat. Now the second three-peat was an 11, 12s, 14s. Yeah, but they don't know. He wore 13s. This is the last shot. They don't give credit to, I don't know why they don't do credit for the 13s, but. Alright, so I have 30 more minutes left and I'm going to leave. My flight is at 6.20, you know, tra LA traffic, you got to go a little earlier, so heading out. But man, what a time, LA, LA vibes, very different, but I miss home, I miss my family, I miss my sneakers, so I can't wait to get home and just relax for a bit, hit the gym, you feel me, get back on the grind. We'll see. Oh, the photo shoots be like. Record this, record this in the camera. I'm dead, hey. Hold on, you're record this video? I'm dead. I'm <laughs> dead, look. What is this? Hook it up for me, you know what Photo shoot fresh? Your fresh one on one class right now. <laughs> hey, Slim. What's up, man? Chilling, How you doing? Yeah, I'm saying, hey, yeah. man. You, you get your bag, though? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so move this ball, right? <laughs> I'm, about to, stop, I'm suing, G. Alright, so we out here. They're all playing 2K, you know. I'm gonna leave soon, but James, oh, I wanna ask you, Kais a couple questions really quick. You ready? Yeah. I'm gonna ask you your most underrated. Most underrated. Out of all of these right here, what's your most underrated shoe? Um, probably this one. Which I don't even know if I could reach. 
about eating up. We gotta wait every day. Oh, oh shit. Careful, chief. The Mamba Curios, I mean, a lot of people oh, don't appreciate the Kobe's like they used to, oh, but man. this is one of my favorites and it's one of the most underrated. Like, the leather, the, in, the, 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 the lining is leather, the bottom has grass, like, details on it. Yeah. The whole shoe is made to look like a freaking material and they turned it uh, Kobe 8 into that and the Kobe 8 is my favorite shoe mm. from the Kobe line, so I really like those. Other than that, like Jordan wise, um, oh man, I think a lot of people slept on these. I haven't worn it yet, but I think this is a very slept on colorway. I, I think these are called, I don't even know what they're called, yeah, but they're called this is like an OG colorway. Sleeping on these. Adidas wise, I mean, any ultra boost. It's tricky. Okay. Thanks, Gillis! <laughs> 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 no, I really I can't really know what Adidas are slept on, honestly, because that's just hype right now, but it's ah, easy that you have. Worst? Worst. <laughs> not, no, not the, not the soccer ones, dude. Not the, the, the clean. Worst, easy. Worst, easy. No such thing. Well, the your least least the least one. Okay, I just don't know why they released three of these, so I'll probably go with the green joints. These are the most yeah. limited out of the V2s too. That's but true. Ella! I just didn't think they should release it in all three colors. But yeah. You're gonna collect them. Low key. Collect them all. All right, last one, G. <coughs> yeah. Most expensive shoe. You gotta go somewhere else. Yeah, other room. Right, so. How do you miss two? Why you lose everything? Right here. My, also, my most one of my most recent pickups, Legends of the Summer, Jordan One. Damn. I mean, can't go wrong. Just look at that G. Talk to you. Special event, huh? Well, yeah, there, yeah awesome. these are these will be worn probably at a very soon sneaker con. Dead stock. Might have to bust out something crazy, you know, break some necks. You won't go and pull these out. Damn. Other than that, it's my Kobe's. But as you can see, Kobe's not in the box because we got surprise guests over here. <laughs> the Kobe's we just wore them, but I mean those and then those and then I mean these are most expensive, but I paid only like I think I paid like thirteen hundred yeah. dollars or something. Come up, like under. Um, but yeah, that's it. You heard it here first. <laughs> I have to show you guys. Let me show you guys these really quick. These are only on the tour, right? Uh huh. Only yep. on the tour. Just came in. Very dope. Shout out to Q. All my friends. So I just got dropped off to the airport and I see a familiar face. Who is it? Who is it? Oh man. What happened? Did LA got to you or what? Yeah, nah, man. I just bought the place. I'm just waiting for everybody to get outside. Damn. With them size 28 on. You know what it is, bro. Boat game. Chilling, man. So, you want to really tell them what happened or not? Uh, okay, so Swag. Swag comes to the room. Uh -huh. All right, well, first off, Clay calls my phone. I'm dead. I'm sleeping, right? So then I hear a knock on my door. The first knock, I think, was like somebody in the hotel telling me, like, yo, you, yeah, you need right, to get out. Yeah. Get out. And I was like, all right, word, yeah, I got you. I got you. So now I go lay, lay back down and go to sleep. Next knock, five minutes later, Swag comes to the door and says, yo, Tony's calling you. Call Tony. I said, yeah, man, I got you. Don't worry about it. Two minutes later, I get back in the bed, I fall asleep. Then I wake up, and it's like 10.44, I think. My flight was at like 12.55, or it was like 11.44. Yeah. Either way, then I had to go downstairs, drop off packages in FedEx. I was just late, bro. So now, instead of my flight at 12.55, my flight's at 10.40. P.M. Yeah. I've been here since like, I've been here since 1 o'clock, bro. Oh my god. I'm just chilling. Like I said, I'm living here now, you know. But I'm just charging up. I'm just, I'm straight up charging up. You're just, just chilling. So yeah, yeah. So Alright, bro. You got anything else to say? Nah, man. I'm out of here. See bro. you soon? Yeah, of course. I'm gonna catch you, dog. Alright, done. <laughs> so, as you guys could see, I am back inside my room. Yes, it is a great feeling to be home. LA was fun. It was turned. It was lit. Saw the crew, we were all together. Shout out to LA, shout out to everyone out there, shout out to Kais, and shout out to SneakerCon, man. It was actually a really great SneakerCon, 
great game. Everything just turned out to be great. So shout out to them and also shout out to Marriott. Yes, the Marriott because they did ship out my package today. This is the next day if you guys are wondering and they shipped out my bag and uh, the basketball. So that's good news, but I just wanted to say thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, trying to think of new ideas, new things to do, possible video ideas. I might do album reviews when they come out. I might do, you know, question and answers, stuff like that. Just other things to try to spice up the vlog. So, yeah. But on that note, thank you guys for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys next video.